Hi, I thought I'd do a little video thingy, trying to find my new little girl here a body, maybe something to wear. But I also brought my um, other little Abitsu 11 dolls. We have little Cosette here. She used to have the short brown wig. Now she has long brown hair. We have Kitten. She's from Sunny Dolls on Etsy. She's really cute. Her eyes are movable. Um, we have Button. She's wearing her wig that she came with. But I like it on her better. And then we have Bunny. And then we have my new little boy. I don't know if I've named him. I was kind of thinking Puddle or Pebble. And he was made, he was just a head that I received from the same artist as this new little girl. Um, these are the clothes I just got from my little box opening with these guys. And an update on that, I messaged the, and when I went and looked at my order, she did have a different hair and I ordered this hair separate because I think I just saw that it was for sale and I ordered another white hair and I messaged them about the missing hair of my other ones and they wrote back saying that sometimes the hairs need to be sprayed and they will be shipped later so hopefully that's the case and the hair is still coming for my other ones so I have new Abigail my little ghost girl and then I have I don't know if I've shown her I don't know why her head just fell off um this is Yatsuba. So she was a Nendroid on an Android body and I put her on an Abitsu 11 body. And then I have my little boy Thunder. And he was the same thing off of a Nendroid body and I put him on this Abitsu body. So I'm going to look in my things and try and figure out um, a body and if we have time maybe an outfit for her I do have new outfits from player doll on Etsy I got this little toast monster outfit these are little pants a little grilled cheese or toast I think it's grilled cheese it says are you hungry this little dress that comes with some little socks it has like a bunny on it and then this little purple monster, it has mismatched socks, mismatched shorts, and purple monster on the shirt. And then this little, like, one piece with the pocket. That might be fun to put on her, if we can get that far without all this time. I have a white wig that I ordered, but I because I had all this brown hair except for hers, so I ordered this white wig, so we're gonna try that on her. And I also have this wig that's kind of a ash blonde that we could try too. So I'm gonna set those over there. Um, oh, I must have gotten these. I've tried to organize everything. Look at these boy shoes I bought. They're so cute. <laughs> They're like little Nike Airs. Um, I've tried to organize everything. These are like shoes and stuff. So I'm going to stick these in there. And I'm going to put my little brown shoes in there because my boy that I bought ordered those for does not have hair yet. Oh, here's the container that my little boy's head came in. Um... I'm not going to organize everything right now. These are my shirts. These are just like fun things. I have like a little dinosaur outfit. I have a couple jackets I put in there. Oh, here's my other ghost face. Oh, and she has a doll. So this is my little Abigail ghost. This is her other face plate that I bought for her. It's not quite, it's still white, but not quite as kind of creepy. And that's her little doll. Let's give her her little doll. If I can get this opened. So here is Abigail's little creepy doll. Yay! 
Welcome home, Abigail. She also has a fancy dress. I thought I saw it separately. So this is all of my Abitu 11 dolls. All of these clothes and everything are interchangeable, even though these are more of an anime looking doll than these. They all have the same bodies. So that's kind of fun. They can all share the same clothes. These are my pants. So I desperately needed more pants. There's some dresses in here. Here's Abigail's fancier dress. Let's see, she's gonna be so fun. And then I have parts for bodies. This was a kind of an obitsu that I ordered off of, I wanted to say AliExpress, but I don't know where I ordered it. It might've been off of Amazon for like four dollars five dollars that was before I ordered any of these I was kind of trying to gauge the size of what they would be before I spent more money um and then I have like little pretty much free things that have come like my little soda pop that I got in my other haul will go in there they're just little props and stuff I have my putty for their necks I also have learned to use plumber's tape around the, the necks to go in there and it's not as sticky as the putty and it holds it just as good. So I will do that with her later. These are the bodies I have. So we're going to try and match a good body for her. This one already has the plumber's tape on it. This is a good body. I think I had this on someone else on the boy, no, but the color didn't match as well. So when I got another body, see I told you I got a little carried away bodies. So I have five bodies. <laughs> I've just been buying bodies. I don't know if I like that. And when they're dressed, it doesn't really matter much about um, Um, the color but if you can get a, a color that matches better that's why I've bought so many is because I ordered some and then I didn't like the shade with the certain clay of the head of that doll this one I ordered and it is taller so I don't know what I'm gonna do with this one it is just a taller the taller body and it's just taller than the rest of everybody. It makes them bigger. So I haven't wanted to use that one. Oh my gosh. Bean. Bean, no. Come on. My cat is going to pull the blanket down. These are decent bodies, but they are more pink. That might work good for her. The only thing is, oh, that would fit. That might be a good color. And then I have this one. These are good. These just Sono bodies are the ones that have. That's what I have on her. They're the ones that have like the soft, the soft hands. And they all come with interchangeable hands. You can change like little fists and stuff. Like I have a fist on her, but I haven't changed much of any. And they all come with these little things. So if you're adapting them to a, an Android, let's see. Oh, these might be the same kind of bodies. Oh, and her hand, these hands aren't soft. I get confused of what body is. I really like this body, but I'm not sure. I've tried to buy the same. See how the fingers are soft. These look like they are all three the same body and the same color. So, we'll just pick one of these.
I mean, if I would order one, and then I'd wonder if I ordered it, so I went and ordered it again. And then, like, I saw him, he was an android, and I thought, well, I need a body for him, so then I went and ordered a body. But some things take so long to ship here that by the time they get here, I forgot about them. So, I'm going to put this on her. Oh, I'm not doing very well. I keep some putty on this little stick. It helps with my blight and the ones that have movable eyes. If they're on the shelf or if I go to take a picture, I already just have some on a, the stick. I don't have to pull any out. I can change their expressions. And I also use it to put on their necks. Some of them have putty, some of them have the um, the plumber's tape. I want to change them all to plumber's tape. So I'm just going to put some putty on here. This might be too much. And her head, I can see like, because she's handmade, I can see like the foil and stuff in there. And I don't want to be pulling that out when I, if I take her head off or if it falls off. And that's part of why I like the plumber's tape because it just fits. It makes a tight fit and it does, it's not sticky. So, there we go. That puts it on well enough for right now. I should have put her body, or her clothes on first. I'm gonna flip this on, hopefully, oh good, it has Velcro. I've gotten a couple outfits, a few outfits, that do not have Velcro on the shirt, and you have to take their head off and put it on, and that is not fun. That's part of why I want to get everybody changed over to plumber's tape, so that when I take their heads off, I don't have the whole ordeal of trying to get the putty from inside the hole, back out, and and everything else. I didn't get her shoes. I want to try and get a wig on her. This is my new little girl. Isn't she fun with her little pig nose? And I, I bought this white wig for her. So let's hope. I got it earlier. I got it because she's taken a little bit to get here. And the wig got here pretty fast. And I tried it on other dolls and I didn't really like it. It didn't go with their complexion. So I'm hoping it will look okay with this new little girl. It's a little messy. And her head seems very big at the top. So let's slip her wig on. <laughs> it actually is cute on her, so that's good. It's a lot cuter than I tried putting it on um, Bunny and it just didn't fit with her eyebrows and her expression. But I'm thinking with little girl here, what should we name her? Maybe little piggy, piglet? I think it's going to be cute on her. So there, there's our new little piglet. She's all dressed and on a body. We will have to straighten her or attach her head. It's still, see it's still tight, but it's a new little piglet and new little Abigail the ghost. And did I already say she does have different hair coming, but this hair, I'm so glad they shipped this hair because I would have been so upset if I got no hair for any of them at all. So that hair is good for now. Where did my shoes go? Here's the shoes. I also have like the little socks in the little socks in here. Um, Midi Blythe 
how hair things. Midi Blythe also fits the same size as a Bitsu 11, which is good because I have my midis, so. Little high tops. Should we just stick those on? Abigail is not gonna have shoes. I don't know if I said that already. These are cute, some cute little high tops with a little heart on them. I don't, I'm not gonna be ordering any more um, a Bitsu 11. I have enough. I actually have too many, but when I saw her little piggy face, I just thought how fun and how different than the other ones, so I wanted her to. Got myself my boy, I got my Nendroids, and I have a little piggy here. So we good. This actually looks too big. That's okay. That's what we got for now. So there's a little pig, little piglet. She got here so fast and she's so adorable. Her little outfit's fun. I don't think I've shown him. It's my little boy. He just came as a head too. I ordered this wig. It had pigtails in it, but I've kind of cut it a little bit to make it look a little layered and like a little boy, kind of a little boy bob. I trimmed the bangs more, but he's cute too. I think his eyes are also movable. They're a little more stiff, but I'm pretty sure they're movable. Yeah, they're movable, but I kind of like the position. I don't want to get them loose, so. Anyway, her little kitten's eyes are way movable. But that's why she has glasses, because hers move so easy. Sometimes she has a little lazy eye. <laughs> so I bought her glasses. So that's all. That's everybody for now until we get the head, the hair for my other two Nendroid Abitsus. So fun. So I hope you like seeing all the things, all the new ones, and sorry it took so long, but that's just how it is sometimes. So we will see you again soon. Maybe do some reborn stuff because that's been a minute and also smart doll there's smart doll things coming and in the works stuff has happened so see you again soon <laughs>